don't give a rat's cockbag how you do it. You'll pull them over and stop them right now. These racers thought they could do whatever they wanted. But the cops quickly put them in their place. These racers either got caught fleeing from the cops or they were detained before their race could even begin. Today, we're going to be showing you some of the most insane clips where the racers were tracked down by the police. The racer that got grappled. On June 10th, 2023, a street racer hit a pedestrian so hard that he stumbled and toppled in the middle of the road. He managed to get up, but the racer did not bother to get out and ask. He had already fled the scene. So when the police got news of his location, they sent a squad and a grappler police bumper after the racer to bring him down. This cop has been trailing this street racer quietly. The racer has no clue that a group of troopers are right behind him. The cop smartly positioned the car right beside the street racer. Just when the moment was right, he grappled at the racer and the car tilted with a crash on its trunk. The other police officers joined in on the scene and trapped the racers to avoid another escape attempt by them. There were two 17-year-olds behind the wheel and were detained immediately. The vehicle was taken into custody and the teens were given orders to be in court. Cops rained down on the racing parade. These car racers were out at night with their spirits high about hitting the highest speed limit on their meters. But their plan came to a sudden stop when they were paraded by a couple of cops. The cop let them go off with a warning, but it definitely got the racers off the street for the night. The dumb racers who thought they got away. A Duluth police officer was on his regular patrol when he spotted two racers trying to go over the speed limit. He got closer and realized they were racing against one another. So he turned on the sirens and rushed after them. When the racers realized they were being followed by a police car, they did not stop. They decided to include the cop in the race too and pressed hard on the gas. The cop tried to chase after them, but they were going way past the speed limit. So he called it off. The dumb racers thought they had gotten away and stopped at Walmart. What they did not anticipate was that the police would catch up on them. At the parking lot, the cops stopped the Nissan and detained the duo immediately. One of them was a 20-year-old who even apologized, thinking that would melt the cop's heart. But as you can guess, it didn't work. The cops found a gun and an energy can filled with alcohol to the rim. The racer said that he only fled from the cop because he had an ounce of marijuana in the car. Bad choice. Because of their stupidity, they now face multiple felonies. Germans detain a car. This couple of German police officers were on the streets in disguise to capture any racer that they had their eyes on. In just a matter of minutes, they spotted one. The special task force was created when a street racer collided with a bicycle, killing a 19-year-old woman on the spot. To stop speeding and street racing, the officers would often raid the streets in the wee hours of the night and detain any car that had modifications. There, it is illegal to do too much tinkering with your car without permit. Most racers do it, fully aware that many changes are illegal. So when they spotted the Audi, they knew it was a race car, as the cops had heard it revving loudly. They pulled a traffic stop and identified many modifications had been done to the car. This racer did not even get the chance to race and he was put to a stop by the cops. They confiscated the vehicle for further inspection immediately. The racer that tried to get away. This racer was pulled for a traffic stop, but he thought he would outrun the cops. He did manage to flee, but he had no idea that the police department had advanced technology up their sleeves. They used an aviation setup to track down the Mustang. You can spot the racer getting out of the car and jumping over a fence to hide. He might have outran the cops, but he is definitely not going to outsmart them. 
trying to hide just beside the Mustang that the police were already after did him no good. He was arrested minutes later. The driver was a teenage boy, and he was immediately arrested by the cops. Five motor racers got pulled over by a cop. These motorcyclists had been racing with one another on a crowded road. They were speeding well over 150 miles per hour. The cop got on an unmarked motorcycle and fooled the motor racers into thinking he was just another random guy on the road. The cop chased them for a good few minutes until he got the lead on the pack. He ordered them multiple times to get on the side of the road. The motor racers still did not realize that it was a cop chasing them down, until finally they stopped and were ordered to appear in court. Police bust, a racing event. In Los Angeles, a race car had rushed through the intersection and collided straight with a local restaurant. The police department had enough of the speeding cars causing danger to the San Fernando Valley. One racer had messed with the wrong police department and the resulting rage was about to come on the rest of the racers in the block. A special task force was created that included over 50 police officers, all handed with the mission of targeting street racers. The day of the crackdown came when a group of racers posted about the event on social media. You never know who is following you. Turns out in the case of racers, it was the police. The cops showed up near the event location and swooped in front of a dozen vehicles. They all denied telling where they were headed and were sent off with a warning. Minutes later, another video was posted of a red Camaro online. Since the cops were after the real racers, they chased down the Camaro 11 miles away from the event. The driver was apprehended, and the only place that vehicle was now going was the impound lot. Cop chases a motor racer. A motor racer probably thought he was in one of those fast and furious movies. He was driving madly on the streets when a cop caught up on him. The motor racer tried to flee, but what he did not expect was that the cop chasing him down would have insane driving skills too. The chase went on for a long time, with more than 10 minutes of action packed in the chase. The cop was not ready to back down and let the racer get away. And boy, did the racer try everything in his power to lose the cop. He swerved and zigzagged on the roads, but the cop had been preparing for this chase his whole life. He was not going to back down on the chase. The motor racer got through slim streets and packed roads to get the cop off his trail, but the cop was not willing to stop no matter the place. He had even come close so many times to capture the racer, until finally, when they were at the intersection. The cop made one smart move and ended up coming just in front of the racer, halting him in his tracks. He had definitely picked the worst day and the worst cop to escape from and ended up in jail instead because of his stupid stunts. Plans for street racing, halted by the cops. This group of racers were all set to drive on the streets and see who would win the crown of being the fastest. Just as they had hit the roads, a bunch of police cars came down on them. They were apparently prowling the streets all through the night. All they had to do was give one warning glimpse to the racers and they were back in the parking lot. They would not dare race when the cops were on patrol. Without doing much, the cops had busted a street racing event and pulled the brakes on the race cars. They had not even touched the speed limit and were sent back off the streets. Now, that's some serious power. Unmarked police car chase down a racer 
This racer was out on the road, thinking it was a good night to hit the speed limit. He was not even driving fast, but the very next second, his intrusive thoughts won over when he saw the open road. He pressed the gas pedal hard and revved loudly. He slowed down a little farther away to shoot out flames out of the exhaust. The moment he did that, a police car came with the sirens blaring loudly. He had almost stopped, but the cops drove by him. He thought he had gotten away, so he sped up the race car again, unaware that another couple of cops had their eyes on him. As soon as he raced his car again, an unmarked police car rushed to its tail. The unmarked police car pulled a traffic stop on the driver and put a brake on his adrenaline rush. An army of cops crash in on a racing marathon. A racing event was prepping up to give the spectators the spectacle of their lifetimes. There was just one problem. The cops had caught the sniff of the event and had come gathered in a huge fleet. While the cars were busy shooting flames, keeping the audience amazed, the cops were parked outside of the event, ready to bring down terror on the racers. One spectator shows a video of cops blocking the roads to stop the racers from fleeing away from the event. They had definitely chosen the wrong place and time to set up the race. There is no way they are getting out of there without getting caught. Police car ended the party for this racer. This racer was revving his car loudly to get the audience excited, but he had also attracted the attention of the cops who were going to bring him down within seconds. While engaging in an afterflame stunt, the car roared loudly and dashed away at a high speed. But not even a minute later, it was stopped. You can spot the police car had already caught up to the driver and had halted him before he could even taste the thrill of the chase. Police raid a racing event. These racers were busy drifting and betting with each other on who was going to win the race. But the one variable they did not take into account was the cops. Amidst the chaos of the event, the loud sirens of the police cars created a whole other fiasco that the racers had not expected. As soon as the cops came, they managed to detain over a hundred people from the street racing event. Some of the drivers got away, but others were caught and charged. About four of the detained were carrying guns that were confiscated immediately. Race car halted on the road. A spectator recorded the most hilarious moment on his camera. This gentleman was driving peacefully across the road when suddenly a race car darted beside him. It raced by so fast that the car was gone in the next blink of an eye. But what happened next was probably the most embarrassing thing for the racer. The spectator then spotted the same race car stopped at the side of the road. A cop had put a stop to the racer's adrenaline rush and caught him in the act. Going over the speed limit definitely cost him the night. Cops chased down a yellow race car. This racing event had just started when a police car had crashed in on their party. While all the racers had waved the white flag, there was one racer who wanted to challenge the speed limit of his car. The yellow racer had the guts to think that it could outrun the police cars. So he revved loudly and pressed hard on the gas pedal. The race car zig zagged through the other cars and went onto the streets. One police car turned into two, but the yellow racer was not ready to back down. Another police car joined in on the thrill of the chase and there were now three cars against one. The footage might have ended there, but it is very unlikely that the racer got away. Who do you think won this cat and mouse race? Cops raided a racing event. This bunch of friends had probably gotten a race car for the first time, but the excited looks on their faces are soon about to turn into side glances of embarrassment. The car revved loudly and they floored the gas pedal. They were out with their phones to record the high speed thrill of their new race car. You can spot them all getting ready to break the speed limit as the engine starts. But they had a little surprise waiting for them just around the corner. 
a group of cops were standing at the end of the road. The driver was forced to stop at the side of the road. The rush of the thrill had not even started, and their spirits were crushed. Look at their faces, they cannot believe it. Racers Come across an unexpected guest. This spectator recorded how the racers got busted within seconds while they were out for a race. Neither the racers nor the spectators would have anticipated the sudden arrest. The camera recorded the racers going way beyond the speed limit to compete against one another. A few feet down the road, a group of cops were waiting for the racers to come their way, and the drivers had no clue. The man even recorded the arrest scenes where a bunch of police cars have the racers trapped in a circle. The racers had been pulling donuts, and well, that easily attracts the cops, doesn't it? From the ones waiting for the racers to come to the finish line to the ones actually racing, they all were detained by the cops. Cops chased down a race car that fled the scene. A racing event was brewing up nearby, and a spectator driving near the event caught the whole scene on his camera. You can spot the smoke filling up the air. It is the smoke coming out of the race cars pulling the donuts. The man was smart. He knew there was a cop car behind him and a racing marathon nearby. As he drove further, the huge amount of crowd confirmed that it indeed was a racing competition that had already started. The undercover cop probably knew because that is when he turned on the siren and gave away his identity. A race car had fled the event and the cops were now after him. The cop car behind the witness sped up and darted past the competition. A few miles down the road, the man recorded the same racer that had fled the event being captured. His car was being towed and a whole fleet of cop cars had him trapped. He was going nowhere now for sure. A thrilling chase between the motor racers and the cops. This group of motor racers were all about evading the police. They had no intentions of getting caught and were down to do anything to escape them. But they had no idea that the cops would outsmart them. A police car came rushing down the road after the racers. They even trapped one racer at the side of the road, but he still managed to flee. He got into the small field and raced his way on the off-road track to lose the cop car, but that was not going to happen. He knew that too. So he slowed down and smartly evaded the cops by pulling on the road from behind them. Then he darted on the road as fast as he could, but the cops were trailing right behind. The chase went on for more than 10 minutes. The racers thought they had lost the cop car at the intersection. But what they did not anticipate was that the police car would catch up on them at the last moment. The cops raced past the drivers, fooling them into thinking they had called off the chase. But in reality, that was not the case at all. The racers had somewhat slowed down on the track, probably laughing about how they got away. Only they were now facing the police car, standing in the middle of the road, halting their path. They never saw it coming. Cops raided a racing event. These racers had gathered the spectators and were showing off their cars. From shooting out flames from the exhaust to pulling donuts, they were all about flexing their vehicles at the event. But the heavy smoke and the loud revving noises had attracted another party who was definitely not invited. The cops. They came raging in a fleet of cars and stormed the event with sirens blaring. The spectators were pushed to the sidewalk and the event was halted immediately. A bunch of racers pressed on the gas pedal and drove away, but not without a group of police cars chasing after them. The event ended right there and then, with no more racers going over the speeding limit to terrorize the streets. Racing Party Stopped by the cops. This parade of race cars was out in the wee hours of the night, probably thinking that they could easily race and compete with each other. But the patrolling cop cars ruined their plans for the evening. A driver recorded more than eight race cars darting at full speed on the road. He then spotted the same cars stopped by the police a few miles down the road. It was definitely not the best day to take out their race cars. Now, 
all the race cars will be seeing the entrance of the impound lot rather than the sweet finish line. That about does it for street racers getting what they deserve for putting public safety at risk. Which one of these was your favorite? Let us know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel while you are at it. We want you to be the first to know when we upload our next video. Until then, stay tuned and thanks for watching.